Assalamu alaikum wa rahmatullahi wa barakatuh. Before everything, welcome. Please make sure you subscribe to this channel and yeah, welcome again. Before I start the episode 4, a lot of you guys, Mulin Uliza, why am I doing this show alone? Because I still don't have a proper studio to host people, so I'll continue telling stories that inspire, uh, that maybe will inspire you, stories that maybe will make you learn something. If you want me to do a good show, a good talk, a good talk show, please make sure you share this video, please make sure you subscribe to this channel, please make sure you support us so, so that we can get a good space, a good studio, and yeah, and we can also invite other guests. So inshallah, this is episode 4, please make sure you watch this video till the end, and yeah, don't go without subscribing, and let's start. <laughs> Building up a mosque for your fellow Muslims is considered to be one of the most noble deeds in Islam. It is sort of a good deed that keeps benefiting you even after you are long gone from this world. I want to share one side story of an anticipated noble deed with you today. A brother duo, both born and bred in Blackburn, have submitted plans for a new building with a dome and two minarets. You might have heard about this super Muslim billionaire brothers duo, the owners of Euro Garage when they recently bought Asda, a British supermarket retailing chain. It is pleasing to see them giving back to the community they grew up in. The brothers duo I'm talking about is none other than Isa brothers. Zubair Isa and Mohsen Isa, aka the founder of EG Group. Both of them grew up in Blackburn, England. Their family originates from Gujarat, India. Long before the Isa family turns, turned into billionaires, their parents used to work in a textile industry. Interestingly, the Isa family continues to live in Blackburn at a 10 minute drive from where they grew up. On 23rd November, the Lancashire Telegraph reported that Isa brothers want to create an iconic mosque in their hometown. The brothers own a, char a charitable foundation that will be responsible for the management part of this noble act. The planning application has already been submitted. Reportedly, the aim of this new proposal is to improve and maintain the principles of community use on the site. The plan includes redeveloping a vacant brownfield site and bringing it back to life for the benefit of the local community. Not only do they want this place to be a mosque, but they are planning to take it to the next level. They have submitted a proposal for the project that provides facility, facilities for prayers, education, training, social care, and community integration. This place will serve as an excellent place of worship that promotes peace and harmony among both the Muslims and the non-Muslims. The statement further added that the community center will be available for the local community irrespective of their color, creed, and religion. This new facility, and to be more precise, this place of worship will provide a dedicated provision for the ladies and children as well. Since the place is situated on one of the key gateways into the into the town, the design of the building will feature a very con contemporary Islamic architect. Note that there is a lack of Muslim community centers or mosque in Blackburn, but this facility certainly will put everything together in one location. We pray that this deed serves as an inspiration for the other religions and promotes even a healthier image of Islam in the world. May Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala make things easier for Isa brothers as they are easing things for the local community. May Allah guide us all and bless us with, with the hidayah so that we keep striving to become better muslims amen thank you for watching that video 
I was your host Mohamed Islam and this is the Dintin Show. Please make sure you subscribe to this channel and yeah, please subscribe, share, like, please subscribe, share, like. Matter the one with a dickle, subscribe, please subscribe, share, like, please subscribe. Okay, I'm joking. Assalamu alaikum.